All right, Gold Rush fans. Well, when it rains, it pours. Episode 7 of Dave Turns Lost Mine, it's in the books. The team, they dealt with a lot, so let's break it down. So, Mother Nature has been beating the guys down since they arrived up here in Alaska. And this episode, it was no different. Mother Nature was throwing everything she had at them. And, well, it almost worked. The team was on the verge of an evacuation. Dave and his team had to stop mining and prevent a disaster from happening before their very eyes. So a change in plan was needed due to their cut being underwater. And they honestly had a great idea. Move old Dan and dig up the ground where it was sitting for the past 10 years. There has to be gold that the trauma spit out and possible good pay dirt underneath. So with all jobs, the less time you have to handle an item, the better. You know, makes things go a little bit quicker. So the team was honestly digging up the pay dirt, dropping it through the grizzly bars, you know, to get rid of the bigger rocks, then re-scooping it and bringing it to the plant. So the team, they were just barely keeping up with what the roach needed. Dave and Nate came up with a plan. They decided to go without the grizzly bars and honestly just process the pay dirt through the plant. So some of Dave's crew, they weren't sold on this idea because they knew something would break. And after a few days, the shaker deck, it broke, and the guys, they're on standby now. So once they were able to get all the water out of the pappy cut, Jason, he finally hit bedrock. This is where the great gold should be sitting at. Dave and his team, they're super excited, but the uncertainty, it's there. So once again, it's my favorite part of the episode. It's all about the gold. So, so far, 39.8 ounces has been mined. In the previous video, I did predict that the team would only get 13 ounces. The mats, they looked great, and they've been fooled in the past before. So this episode, a total of 54.10 ounces was mined, nearly doubling their total for this year, for a grand total of 93.9 ounces of gold. All right, everybody, this has been a Gold Rush Minute. If you like the content, please consider subscribing. I greatly appreciate it. Here's my video asking the question, is Tony Beats sunk for season 13 of Gold Rush? Till the next time.